Good morning, and today we have cameras. I have a couple different cameras. One's a digital camera, and this one, this one's an older camera. This one is nothing like the cameras we use today. It will open up, you would put a roll of film in the back, and then you take a picture and then you have to wind it up, which is a lot of work. The digital cameras are what a lot of people use today. You turn them on, you point, you click, and the, can and the pictures show up right there on the camera. This camera, the roll of film that you would insert into it, you could maybe take 24 pictures. That roll of film then would be developed into a negative. This negative could not be exposed to light. It had to be developed in a dark room with zero light in order for this to be turned in to a picture. Today, we plug in our cameras to our computers or to a printer and we can print pictures off no problem. But do you wanna know what all of this reminds me of? The older cameras and the process of taking a photo and having to be very particular about what we capture to creating the negative, to printing the photo, reminds me a lot about the Old Testament and the process of entering the throne, the throne room and going and talking to God. It wasn't that you could just go talk to God. You had to literally go to a temple then you had to do a ceremonial wash. You couldn't just walk into the temple and just talk to him. And before all of that, or after you were cleansed, you then had to offer a sacrifice. It's a lot of work. And thankfully, we don't have to do that today. Because Jesus came and because Jesus died on the cross and he took our sins with him, we can right here today, where we are, close our eyes and we can talk to God. It's not a long drawn out process anymore. It is something that can be very quick, but yet so meaningful and so powerful because Jesus was the final sacrifice for all of my sins and all of your sins. And we don't have to worry about a 100 step process we can literally pick up our cameras or pick up our thoughts and our requests and we can take them to God right where we are. And there's no need to do anything special. Unlike some film processing, um, we can literally just wherever we are say, God, I just need your time right now. And I am so thankful for not having to go through a process and being able to just close my eyes when I need to and where I am to talk to God. So today, I hope that you're able to remember maybe not the details about each and every camera, but the details about Jesus, our Savior, who died and was our final sacrifice so that we could have access to God whenever we need him. Let's pray. Dear Heavenly Father, thank you so very much for the gift of Jesus. Lord, thank you so much for the fact that it does not have to be like it was and we can, when we need you, where we need you and how we need you, we can just ask. And Lord, we just ask that you guide us and you show us how we can be your light to those we meet. In Jesus' name, amen.